There are pipe bombs that are being mailed to critics of the president. We're finding out the bombs were maybe mailed from, from, Florida. from Florida. Why is this happening now? Why is it happening in your state? I actually think just as a nation, we've seen a complete degradation of the body politics. I mean, the president, at every single turn, he has turned his ire either on political enemies. I think he's tweeted about me three or four times. Why do you think he's picked you? Well, well, I think Florida matters. Uh, you know, I think he certainly sees the, the writing on the wall that if Florida goes blue in, in 18, it may forecast something for 2020. Why is this the moment? for Florida to elect its first black governor. Man, so I have to tell you this. I think that Donald Trump in some ways have created the climate for my candidacy to succeed. His vitriol, his hatred, his pettiness as the president in some ways has caused people to be really furious mm -hmm. about what they feel the country is becoming. Do you feel the weight of history on your shoulders? I try not to think about that it in, in that way, but I do think that my election could be the ultimate clapback to Donald Trump and divisive politics. Ron DeSantis, we talked to his campaign, we talked to his people. They think you're playing the race card. Oh, well, if, if I'm playing it, they dealt it. So what happens if you lose? What I, happens if Ron DeSantis is the next governor of Florida? Well, I mean, then I think that means that they won that round. Um, but I don't think all is lost. I mean, I just think we got to stay in the fight. Um, we lost uh, in 2016. It was pretty devastating to a lot of people. But we've already seen gains just so far in this cycle that at least gives me some hope that we have an opportunity for a comeback.